AI coding is having its breakout moment. Usage for Anthropic's Claude Opus are, is surging 85% this week. For today's tech check, Deirdre Bosa has been experimenting with the tools herself. Deirdre, you built an app, and I love this app. I think we need to put Robin Hood on note. I mean, this CNBC needs to offer this app. It is, I agree with you. I, fireworks when we hit round numbers, the whole thing. Anyway, go ahead. Well, I love that, Kelly. I need to ship it, right? Because I've like created it and actually you can do so. Let me get to that app. I'll explain it to our audience in a moment. But first, Kelly, just this idea that I, with zero technical experience, was able to even make a fully functional earnings analysis tool with just a few prompts, that indeed is a chat GPT-like inflection moment for software investors. They should be paying attention. So my prompt for Claude Cowork, which is the new product, it was very simple. I asked it to make a prototype that demonstrates something called an evade-o-meter. It's an analysis tool designed to automate a gut check. It ingests raw earnings called transcripts to quantify how direct or how evasive an executive is being on that call. So this is what I got, and this blew me away too. It's an actual interactive dashboard ranking the last Meg 7 earnings calls on evasiveness based on hedge words, deflections, and other quantifiers. Meta and Zuckerberg, they got the highest score, meaning most evasive. Microsoft, the lowest, meaning least evasive. Now, <laughs> in my mind, potentially just as or more useful than a professional market terminal. I mean, I will be using this throughout earnings, earnings season. I spoke to uh, Amjad Massad, he's CEO of Replit, which is a vibe coding platform that is even more consistent more friendly than Claude Code. Here's how he sees it. The companies that become embrace agents and become platforms to, for agents and, uh, you know, app vibe coding apps like Replit can build on top of and automate will survive and thrive. Uh, companies that will close down, they will not like create an MCP server or have APIs for people to build on top of, uh, then I think those will go away for sure. Kelly, I even spun up an app for you. It didn't take me very long. I mean, I did it before this segment came on. I'm calling it the Chow Jones. It's a real-time <laughs> dinner stock market that lets your kids buy or short the menu. So too much volatility. And it sets off the emergency pizza <laughs> protocol. I mean, I can ship this with just a button, and you can start using it.